sure the first trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home is still fresh in our minds. We're all still talking about it, there is plenty of hype. But why stop there when we can already start getting excited for the next trailer? Because it sounds like... It's literally right around the corner. So let's get to talking about when we can expect it and the rumors regarding it. Now, of course, this film is due out in mid-December. And if we look at Sony's pattern of releasing trailers, specifically when it comes to their Spider-Man trailers and even their Spider-Man connected films, typically three to four trailers is what they go for. This, again, makes a lot of sense. And as people have pointed out, Sony seems to be sticking to multiple releases this fall prior to Spider-Man. One of them obviously being Venom. So the theory right now is, is that the first teaser trailer we got was exactly that. It was a teaser trailer just to get it out there in front of Shang-Chi, which again, does make sense. If you guys go back all the way to the spring, I was saying the trailer has to hit us right before Shang-Chi, because that makes sense. That's when you want to attach it. But now people are saying that the next trailer is literally already going to be starting to be attached with upcoming fall films, meaning that Venom is more or less guaranteed to have something because it's another big Sony entry and they want to bring people that are seeing Venom over to see Spider-Man or inform them what the film is about. This ties in with all the voice acting for like Tobey Maguire, for example, the international voice actors that were finishing their lines, meaning that the second trailer is rumored to be the one that's going to feature the Spider-Man. So, yeah, you know, um, I'm not going to disagree with any of this because what are you going to do? Put out one trailer and then that's it? Like even Eternals has had three trailers this year and they did their final one and it's rumored that they might actually have a different cut of the trailer coming out as well we still have to wait and see but it does make sense sony needs a couple more trailers out there their marketing for their spider-man films is almost unrivaled by anybody they know how much money they sink into marketing that was one of the things that ended the tasm universe they spent more on marketing than actually making the films specifically tasm 2. so going into this spider-man film you want all eyes on it you want as many trailers out as possible and you want to get the you know widest array of people to take notice of it from various different ages to you know demographics to where you're showing it again yeah i believe a hundred percent we're getting another trailer soon all things considered because logic dictates we have to 